hundred not out. Japan is celebrating the two hundred birthdays of hundred year olds. More than thirty thousand centenarians, as hundred year olds are called, turned hundred this year in Japan alone. There are approximately four hundred and fifty thousand centenarians in the world. USA seventy five thousand, Japan sixty five thousand, Europe one hundred and ten thousand. China 50,000, India 27,000. This would grow 10 times to 4 and a half billion by 2030, and 18 million by 2100. No wonder Time magazine in 2015 predicted that children born in that year could live to a ripe old age of 142. While we are not much different genetically from our ancestors 10,000 years ago, we are taller and stronger. The capacity of our vital organs has improved. Our brains are bigger and process information faster. Advances in medicine is a key factor in increasing lifespan. Am I okay? Sure. We now have the latest medicines to treat you. We all know the things we need to do to keep well: balanced diet, exercise, no smoking, less worry. We also know that learning new things are like exercise for the brain. Learning a new musical instrument, learning a new language, doing crosswords or jigsaws. Scientists have also figured out the exact part of our DNA that makes us age: telomeres. Every time a cell replicates, the telomeres shorten by a wee little bit until they can't shorten anymore, making the cell die. But they have now found a way to slow down the shortening process. So the next time you go buy candles for your birthday cake. You can give me a few hundred. I think I'll need them all. If you like this video, share it with your Facebook friends and like my Bizbo page, and subscribe for free to our YouTube channel, where you will get notifications whenever we post a new story. Bye.